5th of February 2019. Uh, the Property Friends update for February. Well, look, uh, I'd like to focus today on the unfortunate events uh, in far north Queensland with the floods. Um, quick report, um, it's obviously difficult to get detailed and accurate information so early in the piece. Um, can seems to be okay, so there is no flooding reported that we are aware of at this stage. However, the situation is quite grim in Townsville. Um, I've made myself a bit of a list so that I cover every uh, suburb. Bushland Beach, Forest Shores and Sunset Gardens seems to be okay. Um, and Kalinda Chase, Carinia Estate, Oakdale Heights, Stockland, uh, North Shore seem to be okay. Um, it's mainly the areas around the Ross River and specifically due to the Ross River Dam having to open its floodgates that are affected. Inundated for sure are fairways, the golf course, um, Fairfield Waters and the village in Unumba. Uh, we're not too sure yet what's happening with the Haven and Garbutt, but we're seeking information on that. Uh, if I can ask you to channel inquiries and communication through us, the last thing the property managers now need is uh, 300 people, um, contact them for information. Okay, so that was a brief update on the flood situation. Further south and further north, it seems to be all okay. So uh, it seems to be mainly towns where that's affected. Quickly to the RBI. The RBI has left the rate at 1.5% again. So this is since September 2016, the lowest rate that we've had. Um, more interestingly enough, the interest rate forecast, the implied yield curve, is actually saying that the interest rate will go down around the middle of the year further. So that's the RBI saying it itself, i.e. I don't believe there is going to be an interest rate increase, rather a decrease. All right, that was the February update. Have a good one. Uh, let's spare a thought for the last one.